YouTube. Super Chally here. First of all, sorry about the voice. Did a lot of teaching this week, so I lost my voice, so bear with me. Uh, but we are heading back to the drag strip tonight. We're doing a race uh, night at Verona Speedway. I am going to go ahead and put 100 octane fuel race gas into the Hellcat. Um, did a little bit of research on it, and you know, normal daily driving won't really affect it, but putting 100 octane race gas in your Hellcat and taking it to the drag strip may have a better effect, you know, high RPMs, um, a lot more heat going on in the engine. So I did a little bit of research on the internet and the forums, checked it out. People say yay, some people say nay. Uh, so watched some dyno videos too, seemed to be a little bit of power increase. Anyway, we're gonna test it out tonight, see if it matters. Um, probably only need to put about four gallons or four or five gallons of 100 octane in, so maybe it probably only get me to about 95 octane maybe, but hey, we'll see what happens with it. Uh, we got all the stuff ready to go right now. Water, snacks, cables, suction cups. Gotta get my shoes on. We're gonna get in the kitty cat. We're gonna head out to the gas station and uh, get some painters tape beside the car. Yeah. All right, we got the goods. We're gonna get tired in the car. All right, let's go get some octane. Well, we made it. It's out in the cut, but we got to the... All right, guys, we just got some 100 octane in this thing. An accidental gallon of 87. I don't know what happened. Uh, hit the 100 thing. It started pumping 87. Killed that. Put 100 in there. Topped it off a little bit of 91. Um, so probably sitting at about 95 octane. So we'll see what happens when we get to the track. We're gonna head there. Traffic is horrible, so I won't bore you with that drive. Get there, get set up, and uh, see how this thing uh, goes down the track with some higher octane fuel in it. <laughs> guys so I ran a 7.8 that time which was way better uh, than the other passes I took I think I got a what was it two flat 60 foot with stock tires so it's not too bad um, so we'll just try again in 96 miles an hour so we'll see if we can get any higher than that uh, yeah so that's a good baseline first run before the other ones were just you know complete warm-up so we'll see what happens after this Last night from the drag racing, uh, as you can tell, car is still taped up. Still got my numbers on the side of the car. Um, so as for the 100 octane test we did in the car, um, nothing crazy happened. Um, I will say though that the times were way more consistent. So my first couple runs were terrible, just when the, the track was really cold. It was probably about 59 degrees outside. Really good temperature for the car, uh, but the track was a little cold, so traction was a thing. Um, so seven nine, seven eight, and a eight flat on stock tires. Um, now, usually, where the changes come into play is usually I'll run like one seven seven or a seven eight with these uh, with these tires right here. I don't have drag radios yet, working on it. But um, last night it was way more consistent with the lower. Lower times. So usually I run like a 7.7 and I'll be in the, in the eight ones, eight twos for the rest of the day just because of heat soak. So what happened is the 100 octane definitely prevented the car from pulling timing and losing power, but it didn't necessarily give me any any advantage over, you know, like a huge horsepower gain. Like I knew it wasn't because the car is obviously not tuned for it. I did want to see if the, uh, 
car would not pull timing and it definitely didn't. So the power maintained throughout the whole night and the, the temperature was cool, you know, but here I am with a hundred octane in there with, uh, you know, stock Pirelli tires on there, but you know, it's all fun. Uh, just trying to see, you know, so maybe I'll, uh, not put 50 bucks in the gas tank with uh, five gallons of gas next time. Maybe I'll just go get like a, like a, maybe a Lucas Oil Octane Booster, one of the better ones that actually pumps it up in points. But uh, we'll see what happens and uh, I'll try to get drag radials for then. But uh, it was all good fun. Uh, let me guys know what you think. If you get this has worked for you or if it has not worked for you. Um, yeah, and if you like the video, subscribe and leave me a comment below. Peace.